Hello everybody, welcome back to Malvern Junction. Uh, I just want to show you guys what I purchased today from the, my model shop. Uh, so here's the fingers. Uh, this sort of thing is ready when I build my layouts of Malvern Junction. Now, I'm going to show you guys what I purchased. First of all, it's a uh, a ratio kit 537, it's retaining walls. This is uh, a pack of two, that is at Malvern Link, so I'm going to use that as for Malvern Junction. I've got some set track platform system, it's a two stroke platform units. What I wanted is the, uh, the platform edges, so I might make use of the platform itself. Uh, I bought some Pico second hand, these are good quality, they look unused, good quality second hand Enzo Frog Pico track, I mean you look at, this is Pico, and I was just going to show you the difference between the Pico and the Hornby, bear with me. Ok everybody, this is a Hornby track. Now you can just about see they're saying Hornby R8073 and this is Pico and this is Pico England ST-240 Now you can tell what Insofrogs Hornby's are bigger, Pico's are smaller now I still keep uh, the Hornby points, but I'm starting to buy some of these. These are set traps, so uh, the both the same geometry and measurements, exactly the same. Horn, Hornby and Backman are the same. Pico, it's got the same dimensions as Hornby and Backman. So if people know about set track, you can understand what, where I'm coming from. Now. I purchased two rights and two lefts. I didn't know Pico had the old packaging of a bag. <laughs> and you can see the point in there. Look at that. <laughs> That's in the bag, literally. No word of a lie. I was surprised when I had a look. There, there's, there's a point. There you go. I know Pico will come up to me and offer me millions of pounds just to have these two. It's like a piece of history here. <laughs> they went from there on the points to something like that for the points to something like just plastic. <laughs> it, it's, it's all changed. This is Pico's history here. <laughs> so yeah, I've got those uh, from Alvin Junction. Uh, I've got these. These are platform amps, because uh, I might in the future I might do Great Malvern and uh, Worcester Shrub Hill or Fourgate Street, I might do both, I don't know yet. But I can get some more of these, I know I can, but I think I already have got some of these, I don't know. I'm going to have a look, I'm going to need a box just to put them in, a box to put these sort of things in, a box to put that sort of thing in together with that so I'm going to organise myself a lot more better uh, I've already got two of these but I've got uh, another one of each because it's a special Coca-Cola train I've got myself a Great Western Railway conflict with container I have got one of these over there somewhere um, but I've just thought I'll get another one of those that would be suitable with two of those and one of those. I've got another two of these, so I've got four all together in Great Western Railway colours. This is a cholesterol car, an actual four composite coach corridor type. Um, I've got myself a treat, a Terrier R2679, 069, uh, 060, sorry, formation. Uh, Terrier class A1X. And I believe it says 
Port Sheed or something like that. Somewhere in uh, the harbour of Bristol, I've been told. And it's an absolute beautiful lifeguard. I will do a separate video on that, unboxing and reviewing it. I will do that for you guys. And a model Huawei Design Manual. This cost me a few quid. And it's just like tips, bits and pieces of what I can do, track plans and etc. So that's just a little trait for myself. Oh, there's something here. Oh, paper clip. Obviously somebody was making one or two plans, I don't know. I'll get rid of that. So there you have it. That is what I purchased so far today at a train model shop. And uh, that is it. So I just want to say thank you guys for your support or watching my videos. Uh, I've had so many people that have viewed uh, the information of my channel. I've had about 50 odd views so far. Uh, I did release a video sometime last night. So far, within 20 minutes of having it uploaded onto my channel, one viewer had a look at it. So I'd just like to say thank you so much for viewing that. It could be a friend of mine that is in America. So thanks, mate, if it was you. <laughs> and uh, there you go. I will do some more videos. I've even got sick of plans about the layout that's going on around here. But I'll explain that to you guys another time. So thank you so much for watching. Have a great weekend guys and stay safe. And I'll see you again soon. Take care for now guys. See you.